Hi, BC. It's Aaron, Mutha Alamer. Today I'm entering a contest for Mike and Patty over at MGK Boston. Now, Mike's a great guy. I've got to know him pretty well over the last few months, and uh, we comment on each other's videos. And this push for a million contest is kind of crazy because back a couple years ago, I uh, when I was coming up with my idea for my thousand subs contest i was actually going to do a push to a million contest because like mike i never asked for subs and i thought it would be an interesting idea i was going to go through i had it all worked out and planned out i asked a few of my friends in the vinyl community if it was a good idea they were kind of back and forth on it i decided not to do it but i had it in my back pocket i was going to do it later on sometime but i'm glad if anyone's doing it to you mike um you know on my uh for mine i was going to have you know i was going to have tell everyone to create all these extra channels like fake channels just to put subs out and for everyone they did i'd give them another entry and i was going to give a like a hundred dollar prize and then for the million subscriber when i hit a million i was going to let them um you know choose anything from my record collection but i was going to do it kind of like the jerk like in the jerk the movie and i was going to you know start out with anything from the collection then narrow it down and pretty soon it'd be just a little small area of records that they'd get it was just a weird idea i had but i thought i'd share that since this is his push to a million subs hope you get there mike you're uh you're a great guy in the vc and this is a really cool idea um three wedding songs and i got a real three really good ones in mind and the first one here is one of my favorite songs from the 80s and this artist really doesn't get as much credit as he should he's from uh he's from san francisco had a string of albums in the 70s and 80s and i love all of them and it's greg ken this is actually a solo not the great kid man just greg ken but it's a song called whenever and it's always been one of my favorite slower songs. You know, I gravitate toward the faster ones, but I've always loved the song whenever. And I still to this day, I can't believe nobody has, you know, remade that song and turned it into a huge hit because it's a phenomenal song, great lyrics, great for a wedding. And um, I'll let you see, I'll, I'll play it right now.
me see that was Greg Kinn with Whenever. Now my second choice is going to be from one of my all-time favorite bands. They only had two albums in 1990, 1991, and this is my favorite power ballad of all of all time by anybody. I absolutely love this song, and it's from Sweet F.A. on Temptations called Your Love. Now the lyrics are perfect for a wedding. It's a perfect love song, uh, just an absolute great song. I, when this was out, I thought this was going to be a number one single. It was in 1991, so it's when the, the change happened and all the grunge was coming in. Now, Sweet F.A. is kind of uh, the end of the hair metal, but they were a lot more bluesy and uh, a little more raw, really good musicians. And Your Love, my favorite power ballad of all time, perfect for a wedding. And I actually used all these songs for my wedding reception back about 11 years ago. I um, I actually recorded or had a person uh, record a bunch of songs on the three CDs for me. I picked out all the songs and all these songs were at my uh, wedding reception. So, Your Love from Sweet F.A. Let's see what you think. <laughs>
Now the final one is probably the perfect wedding song. And before I got married, I was with my wife and we went to a wedding reception and I don't dance. I'm not a dancer, I don't dance. And you know, I'm, I'm still stuck in the old, the, you know, the old days where they were putting records on. So I said, okay, if they play this song, I'll dance. Thinking they would never play it, they wouldn't even know what it was. So of course she went up to the DJ and, and it came on a few minutes later and I was stuck, had to dance. And it was like the only time I dance and I, I'm a horrible dancer. So it's the song Touch by Johnny Lang from this album here. This is of course my favorite album by him, Long Time Coming, but Touch, what an amazing song. And it kind of became uh, mine and my wife's song because of that, it's kind of funny. And it's just an amazing song, I love it. And great luck reaching a, a million subscribers, Mike. You're a great guy and <laughs> I hope you get there. And everyone, I'll see you next time and check out the song Touch. Here we go and I'll see you on the next one. Just a friend to you All I wanna do, do is get to know you better Now I wanna give my heart to you Tell me, do you feel like I do When we're together Cause I come alive with your touch I'm wasting time.